Yo, what is up guys, and in today's video, I'm just going to be updating you guys um, on a couple of my previous videos, because recently AMD brought out a new update for the Radeon um, software, and in my previous videos, a lot of you guys were saying, oh, they brought out a new update, I can't find it, I can't find um, saturation, I can't find display, and I would recently just went into the software to see if uh, I can find it and uh, it's still very simple to find it but some of you guys just may not actually be able to locate it so that's what I'm gonna do guys I'm just gonna show you exactly where it is so let's get into it so guys first of all you're just gonna right click click AMD Rage on software and also one of you did comment saying that you can't find uh, you can't find uh, display settings so guys of course to get to display settings you can either type it in here or if you want to do it just for a, a specific game uh, in this case we're just changing the saturation of CSGO you would want to click CSGO and this is where you would do it you guys were saying that you can't find certain things uh, it may be because you haven't downloaded the most recent um, Rage on software. So if you literally just type in AMD Rage on software on Google, click the first link. I have made a video on how to download it. Uh, my last video actually. Check that out. You do need it. Um, and yeah. So then guys, once you have clicked on Counter Strike, all you're going to do is scroll down. And here where it says custom color after the new update it will be disabled okay you then have wanna you then want to enable it okay and you guys recognize this this is how you would do it before it's just that they added this uh, new software where you can enable it disable it uh, or whatever so it's literally saturation back here put that back to 200 and now when you do um, load up your game it should now automatically change the saturation up to 200 um, and that is a new method um, I didn't disable it once you do update your your drivers once you do update the software uh, that setting will be defaulted to, to disabled so guys you do need to go into your settings and enable that and that is all it is guys it is very simple um, I hope this did help um, uh, those that you know were struggling to find it and if you guys did enjoy leave a like and subscribe almost at 100 subscribers and about 15 away um and yeah thanks for all the support on the other videos i'm on about 15k on one uh, that's insane and yeah hope you guys are doing well during this period i know it can be boring so i hope this uh did help you guys and i'll see you guys in the next video peace